Hey everybody, Kneecap here. This video is going to be how to do this new uh, world quest on Isle of Watchers called Not Gonna Happen, kind of like the name. I'm actually going to fly to Warrenger it out and go straight to it. If you are a little unsure of yourself going through kind of these elite mobs, you can just coast the shoreline and get there that way. But I am going to actually go right through everything. Alright, I'm arriving here at Warden's Redoubt. And I am going to, as I said, go right through the island here. And just kind of avoid everything that I can. If you aren't sure this way, you know, you can coast the shore. But to me, this doesn't seem like a big deal. I have seen people say, though, that they, you know, prefer to take the safe route. Which is totally respectable, too. You see, it's not really that unsafe, but... <clears throat> Just have to look out for these... fell hunting dog-looking things. And we're gonna be killing these Naga. Hate coils, so it's kinda like hate the hate coil. I'm gonna help this people out. <laughs> They're struggling a little bit there. They don't have very much health, so definitely soloable. As long as you have the gear and the self healing, of course. These guys are invited to a group, so I'll accept. Um, if you want to see kind of how to completely solo this, this reminds me of Hate the Hate Coil. So you can just uh, you can actually look up my Hate the Hate Coil video, and that'll give you a good idea of how to solo it. But I'll, I'll keep grouped up with him for this one. We'll make it faster anyway. So you're gonna have melees and uh, these casters. Now, both of them can hit relatively hard, but the uh, the melee is gonna typically hit you harder. Than the caster, plus the caster is able to be interrupted. I guess if you just let the caster free cast, that it might be similar damage, but the melee is going to do much more. I'm kind of I'm doing fine. My rogue buddy here is getting hurt pretty bad, though. Heal him up, and then you just keep going and finding him. Let's see. My quest objectives are not tracking right now. I also have to kill three Ocean Guardians, so let's go try to find an Ocean Guardian. So we're not only killing the Naga, we also have to kill Ocean Guardians. I imagine maybe that's going to be a giant? Hmm. Is that an Ocean Guardian? There we go. So let's, let's go ahead and kill a giant. They only have the same amount of health as the other thing, so shouldn't be too bad. Can run out of that undertow. Kind of fitting to be undertow of the giant. They are stunnable, just like the Nagar. <clears throat> and if you're like anything like a Rep Paladin, you do like all your damage when they're stunned. You're spec like me. So not too bad. The rogue went, left my group, so this will end up being a solo video. Um, he probably was like, what are you doing over there? Just killing some ocean guardians. So they do a kickback and then they undertow, which I did not get out of that time. Hunt. So, got out of that one. Hunt. Very repetitive little creatures. So that's two of my uh, three ocean guardians done already. Excuse me while I go mine this falsely. Don't know why my uh, quest tracker is not working, but. Can look at the map and see how I'm doing. 
Um, four more Naga and one more Giant. So I'm not even going to fight him. I don't know if he even counted or not. Let's see here. There is a bit of a sparse population. All things considered. There we go. There's some more over here. So you'll, you'll find a lot more of these on the northern side, it looks like. There's a group of three. I probably don't want to fight those. Um, I don't know what those are that thing was running after, but oh well. Gotta make sure I don't pull any crabs here. You don't want crabs, everybody. Just keep them interrupted. Naga. Kind of want to do a pull of three just to see if I can do it, but I will try to avoid dying instead. There's these Owls of Watchers all over on this island. There we go. Active expression on target, reducing their damage and movement speed by 50%. That's pretty cool. So you can actually use that Owl thing to make a target hit less in it. Appears to have two charges and buff lasts five minutes. That's pretty cool. I'll go ahead and use it on him. They actually let me pull him by himself as well. Don't know if that's a intended thing or not. So damage done in movement. So that, that's really a great thing to put on somebody if you're trying to kite. Because they'll never catch up to you. 50% damage or speed reduction and damage reduction, but I'm not going to bother doing it on this one. That's kind of neat though. I've seen those all things up before and I've tried to use them and it didn't have any effect, so kind of neat that that one worked. After this, I should need one Naga and then one Giant. So we'll find a singular Naga here. I'll go ahead and suppress him with my new cool ability there. Naga down. Now we just need to go back and find one more giant. I'm assuming they're all going to be by that cave. I haven't seen any anywhere else. I believe this is where like the world boss Calamitous was. There's a giant going down. I don't know if I'll have to go inside the cave or what, but because they don't be, appear to be too many outside. No, definitely have to get them outside. There might not be very many spawns of these. I'll keep exploring around and try to find if there's any more uh, spawn points for the giants themselves. I mean, it has them all around the outside here, maybe. Hmm. Sometimes I like to wade in the water, so could be out here I guess. Doesn't look like it though. Hopefully they didn't only put two giants in this whole thing. That's gonna be a lot of people fighting over giants when you need to kill three. But I am gonna give a little look see across everywhere. Looking like they only spawn right there at that cave. 
So you'll just have to wait. Um, only it looked like earlier when I first got here, only two spawned. So you'll have to just wait until you can get one to spawn again. Spawn by the giant fire. And we'll get the last giant down here. All right, that's it for not gonna happen. Um, thumbs up and sub, and everyone have a good one.